Hey guys, how's everybody doing today on this Thursday morning? You'll probably see this video maybe tomorrow, I'm not sure, but I went shopping to buy some healthy foods for me, things I'm gonna be eating, and um, I just wanna share a little bit of what I got with you guys, so if you guys are interested, just keep on watching. Okay, first thing, I'm gonna show you guys some lettuce. This is the premium romaine lettuce. One of them, and it has romaine, lettuce, carrots, and uh, red cabbage in there. Then I have a bag of fresh spinach. Yum, yum, I love this, this is so good. I like to mix this with this type of lettuce here. It makes it taste better, not so bland. Then I got a bag of green kale, organic green kale. That's gonna be yummy. Then I got some blueberries. Love blueberries, they are so good. They're not too sweet, but they're good. Then we have some fajita blend. These are um, bell peppers, the green, the red, and uh, some onions mixture there. Then we got some strawberries. Turn this around. Aaron likes these strawberries too, so he better not find his grandmother in these because we're going to have to share. That's right. Organic bio logic key. Okay, we'll leave that word alone. <laughs> I cannot. <laughs> I can't do it. But anyway, you know what I mean. Then the hubby got himself a apple and walnut salad with chicken. Now, this does look delicious. But if I were going to eat it, I would have to take out the feta cheese because it has feta cheese in there and the chicken and the little sauce here. That's what I would take out for myself and just eat the rest of it. But this is his. Then I got a few, um, what are these things? I got a few avocados. Bag full of uh, tomatoes because you gotta have a lot of tomatoes for salad. And my hubby is laughing at me. <laughs> yes, I'm talking to you guys. But anyway, that's okay. Then I have some, um, I don't know if you guys can see these. These are uh, cucumbers. I think these are cucumbers because I did get some squash too. Let me just poke a little hole in there so you guys can see. Yeah, these are cucumbers. And this bag right here is um, zucchini. I love zucchini. I like to slice this up and make it into a concoction type of dish with some bell peppers and things like that. And it's really good. Or well, sometimes I just fix it by itself and eat it that way. Then, got some rice cakes, the lightly salted. And this is the plain one. I like these and I also like the cheddar cheese, but I don't eat the cheese anymore. So I just leave that one alone. Then I got a few green bell peppers. Got some bananas. This is mostly for the household because I don't eat that many bananas anyway. I try to eat half of one or at least a quarter piece of it. Okay, on this side, I got two packages of red beans. These are our favorite. Love red beans. I got that broccoli slaw that I told you guys about that I like to mix. Sometimes I'll mix it in my salad or sometimes I will um, steam it and get it slightly cooked, but not, you know, not too much. Then I got some parsley flakes. Then Cubby picked up this organic multi-grain bread and seeds. I don't pretty much eat bread too much, uh, but I might take one slice. We'll see, I don't know. But what I will eat, and this will be on occasion, not often, because I, I try to limit myself of eating bread, you know, because bread is kind of thick, it's, it's heavy, but at least these are the good, healthy kinds. You know, you just have to be careful. But I got two of these, these double fiber um, English muffins, and these are pretty good. The way I eat it, I don't put butter on mine. After I toast it, sometimes I will eat it plain right after 
you know, right, right after it comes out of the toaster. And sometimes I'll spread a little bit of almond butter on it. That makes a nice little meal there. So I got two of those. Then I, this is something new I picked up. I wanted to try it. This is called the rice and quinoa. It's brown, red, and wild rice with quinoa. And it's by Minute. What is that, Minute Made? No, just Minute. By Minute. And it has 10 packs. And you can just put them in the microwave. So I thought, hmm. No, it has 10. Oh, no, it's four bags. I thought it was 10, because I see that 10 right there. It says ready in 10 minutes. Oh, I guess I was wrong. But anyway, I'm going to try that and see if I like it. Then this Boom Chicka Pop sea salt popcorn. This is pretty much for the household. Uh, I don't eat popcorn as often as I used to. Um, once in a while, I'll pop a bag. You know, like I'm trying to kind of like... Um, reduce the number of times you know that I do eat it I'll try to do it at least once a month maybe twice it just depends on how the week has gone you know my calorie intake uh, I kind of monitor what I'm eating and the calories versus you know other things so every now and then I will try this and Hazel, you asked me to let you know, let you guys know about this popcorn, and I did taste it. It is good. There's nothing spectacular about it. It just, it doesn't have, um, I don't think it has any butter in it. I have never tasted any butter. And if it does, then I know I'm not going to be eating any of it. But it says whole grain, non-GMO, gluten-free, uh, it has 35 calories per cup popped. So, do your arithmetic on that. But it's four bags in this box. But it, it's good. I like it. So, try it if you want to. It's by Angie's. And then we have another one. This one's called, this is mostly for the household. Because I'm not gonna, definitely not going to eat this one. This is the real butter popcorn. So, it's by the same, same uh, company, Angie's. I won't be trying that one. But this is the one that's a little more healthier. Then I got some whole natural almonds by Blue Diamond. I was debating whether I wanted to, you know, try the um, the one that has sea salt, light sodium. And th that's the one that I usually eat and I used to always pick up. But I'm trying to reduce the amount of salt in my diet. So I said to myself, mm, let me go ahead and just get this one because that's the only way to do it is just to try things you know buy things without the sodium in it so maybe one day down the line I will you know occasionally have some of the other kind then we got some Uncle Ben's boil in a bag brown rice the whole family eats this because we don't eat white rice anymore and uh, this is a little healthier. It's natural whole grain, and I try not to eat too much of it because, you know, it is a carb. And I'm trying to watch carb. I'm trying to watch everything because I want this weight off of me, like, today, okay? Then I got a pack of uh, pinto beans. This is the uh, biggest size that I could find. They had some two small ones, you know, like individual, not individual, but little packages that are sliced in half like this. But I decided to go ahead and get the big one here. Then I found some thyme, thyme leaves, and I ran out of it. This is good, this is a spice you put on your food. And it helps to flavor it. No seasoning, no salt in there either. Then this is something new that I'm trying. I, uh, I've seen it in the grocery store many, many times and I said maybe one day I'll pick it up. And this, this is the Emerald 100 calorie packs of uh, natural walnuts and almonds with dried cherries. So this looks interesting. Looks like it would be really good. Then us, the whole family, we like to drink these Bay or Bai drinks these antioxidant infusion drinks these are really good 
Um, I got the pomegranate one. And then um, I think my hubby got watermelon. They have different flavors, as you can see. And I got a blueberry. I'm not sure which one we got for Aaron. Strawberry lemonade. This this one really, really tastes good. This tastes so good with the strawberry and lemonade. You know, lemon mixed together. It is really good. I can't find the one that we have for Aaron, babe. You said you got yourself three? Yeah. Uh, you Something's missing. One, two, three, four, five. We only have five. Oh, boy. Pomegranate. I got that. I got that one too. I don't see a pomegranate. You said you got yourself a pomegranate. Yeah, you don't see them. No pomegranate. There's water. Two watermelons. One blueberry. And one strawberry lemonade. Then, puppy got this uh, new sparkling ice drink. It's a strawberry watermelon. Uh, type of antioxidant drink with vitamins, it says, with zero sugar. Mmm. I wonder how that tastes. Zero sugar, huh? We will see. Okay, last but not least, just a few more items on this side here. We got some stevia in the raw packets of 100 in a box. I don't use stevia, um, but the household does, whoever wants it especially Aaron, he'll put it in his oatmeal because he does not want to use regular sugar and I don't blame him. Sugar is scary, I tell you. Then I just had to get my U-Ban, you guys. You know how much I like my coffee. I'm not getting, I'm not giving up my coffee. So I'm gonna drink it, U-Ban, and enjoy it. Then we got some quick oats, oatmeal, by great value. Got another bottle of Himalayan salt that I was telling you guys about. Himalayan pink salt. And then I have two cans of lentil soup, which is organic. I like this because I like to add different things in there. Like for instance, sometimes I will add like maybe, maybe a teaspoon, a teaspoon or tablespoon of rice, brown rice, and um, Maybe I might slice some onions in there, a little bit of bell pepper, just to make it into a delicious meal, and it's really good. And last but not least, we have some sunflower seeds. I like to sprinkle this on my salad, as well as sometimes I'll sprinkle it a little bit on top of my uh, cut up vegetables. You know, like carrots, I'll slice some carrots and cucumbers and just sprinkle a little bit on top of that. Okay guys, that's going to conclude this video. Oh, one more thing. I had to get something for the teeth. Now, this is part of health, so gotta have some, um, what are these things? These, um, oh my gosh, these floss. These are floss, so I floss my teeth pretty much after every meal, so. Now, this will conclude this video. I hope you guys have enjoyed seeing our healthy grocery haul. Thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you guys have an awesome day. Bye.